Kia ora, ko Stephanie Tuka Ingawa, haere mai, welcome to Adaptive Go. Today I'm thinking about whether I'm going to start the training for Ramon to become a service dog. Matt, down. Yes. Stay. This is Dan. She's come to um, give me some tips on uh, training Ramon. I had Jan Voss here from ACE Training. She was amazing and she's worked with service dogs before and she has a relationship with perfect partners. It's pretty tricky in New Zealand getting your owner dog certified to become a service dog. It's the law that um, to put on a service jacket he has to be certified and there's only a, one organisation that will work with owners and certify owner trained dogs. What you've done is first of all not not wanted to certify your dog tomorrow basically mm. which is a good start because again people approach them and they say hey I've got this great dog you know can I get it you know without recognizing the time that goes in. Um, I understood that it's quite a long and involved process and we have to be so careful through the process that we certify the appropriate dogs and we don't run it for everybody else. I mean the advantage with using a clicker and why a lot of service dogs are trained with clickers is that you can very easily translate into other trainers doing stuff you've got right. consistency. I see, so right. you can so you know what the clicker is. Or the member of the family or anyone, anyone yeah. that's doing stuff with it you've just got a really easy yeah. way to get consistency. It's also a way of getting very accurate markers if you're trying to identify for instance if you were teaching him to do a, um, a good yes good boy. No. Yeah, so you're going to fix that. Or you're going to get a clicker because it's easier to focus on the clicker and know that, the, that, that when you click is when you're giving a yes. So what we talked about with Jan was loose lead walking as well. I've been using um, a spring based lead to take some of the pressure off my hands when I've been um, teaching Ramon how to um, do a loose lead walk and I've had it tied around my waist, which has been a real lifesaver when Ramon took off at speed one day and ripped the um, lead out of my hands. But what Jen showed me was how to hold a lead. So what Jen showed me is a different way of holding the lead um, so that it doesn't hurt my hands, gripping it like handlebars, wrapping it around my thumb so that it's much harder for him to pull it out of my hand and also wrapping um, it round on my other hand. Now if he pulled it's all going to be held um, quite nicely. Um, I have the added complication of adding in my walking stick. Now when he goes to pull ahead like he's doing, as he goes where he goes to jump out and pull ahead, let's stop, let's take a step back, let's use our touch tube. Let's go. So when he's pulling ahead I stop and I do touch, 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 get him, yes, get him in the right position, ready to start again, let's go. It's about the fun play, what they call the hope method, you right. toss the thing out and you hope they bring it back, yeah. right? um, especially for an assistance dog you want it to be something that they see that they enjoy, that it's fun, that they get yeah. you know, rewarded for and, and, and have fun with, yeah. but that you actually present to them in a fairly um, structured way. Right. So one of the things with um, Ramon is that uh, features a little bit of what Jan calls fetch and hope. So uh, she's taught me how to um, start the training for a really good retrieve that will become really solid. So we're gonna show you how to do that now and all I'm doing is getting him to touch this with his nose but um, I think he's already started um, mouthing it which is um, great because that's the next step. Yeah. Yes! Good boy! Yes! Yes! Good boy! Yes! Yes! 
so he's got this pretty nail within um, one day. So I need to go back to Jan and find out the next step. Yes! Been too much of Ramon to think about becoming a service dog. I think you need to be realistic about the physical limitations of the tasks that you're asking. Right. I'm not uh, pushing cupboard doors, opening filing drawers, things like yeah. that, which is um, you know, what a lot of other service dogs do. Yes, I could see him doing that. Heavier doors or gates or things might be a bit difficult. Yeah. And the um, unless your house has been already designed with um, mobility in mind, so a, yeah. a, a house designed for a wheelchair, for instance, will have door handles that are artificially yeah, low right. from a standing yeah. person's point yeah. of view. Um, in which case, putting a uh, putting something on a ha on the handle and having him pull it is much more realistic right. or whatever. So there's some limitations about what he so might be able to achieve at height and... But his breed is bred um, as a watchdog. Yeah. Hi guys! Oh, wow. So he doesn't bark at the strange person at the gate that he'll bark at. <laughs> <laughs> Tom and uh, Ollie. It's yeah. partly the startle effect of you know somebody appeared and all of those yeah. things. But if we can predict that that's the situation that we know is going to happen, that's when I would step in and micromanage. So right. I would sit, step in and go, do this, so direct before, this, yep, yeah. before, rather than letting you rehearse the wrong thing. Yeah. Because by the time you've barked and gone over there, mm. very hard to um, very hard to stop it because it's already happened. Yeah. Very hard. Uh, we can still call him back and we can still redirect him, but it would have been more efficient to mm. beforehand. Yeah. We may get all the way through the training and he can't be a service dog and can't be certified, but I think where I'm heading is I'm probably going to give it a go. Yes. So to be or not to be, that's the question I'm answering. Do I want Ramon to be my service dog? Do I want to put in all that time and commitment to be able to get him certified? I'm working through that, so subscribe so you can um, see my next decision in this journey.